Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hey, in this video, I wanna show you the ship that you gotta get early in game because this thing is so powerful. It can carry you, I'm telling you, I'm still using this ship. And my current level, I'm currently level 47 in this game with almost 70 hours into it. And this ship still can carry me. This ship is called the Star Eagle and it has everything you need to get by in this game for a very, very long time. It is easily the strongest early game ship in Starfield. So first let's turn around, I'll tell you how to get the ship, and then I'll give you a quick walkthrough. We'll go through the interior, you can see what it's like and what I love about it. So to get the Star Eagle, first thing you need to do is come to Aquila City. If you don't know where that is, pull up your star map. It's in the Cheyenne system. So for reference, we've got Alpha Centauri and Sol right here. The Cheyenne system is just up here. Boom. Once you travel here, there is the planet Aquila. Boom. And Aquila City is right there on the surface of the planet. Once you've made your way here, you're gonna walk down the main strip of Aquila City and there's gonna be a bank on your right. Right here, this is the Gal Bank. There's gonna be a little bit of a standoff happening where you've got robbers in the bank and you've got the marshal and his rangers outside of the bank. You're gonna step into the situation, try and help broker a peaceful resolution to that situation. After you do that, you are allowed to start your faction quest line with the rangers. So talk to the marshal. He'll ask you to report right here to the rock. And when you go into the rock, you will uh, meet one of the rangers. She'll get you set up and you'll start that quest line. That quest line is very, very good early game because it's gonna give you some really powerful weapons as well, including a very strong pistol that can carry you for several levels. Now, I will not give you any spoilers for that faction quest line. It's a really fun quest line. I want you to figure it out on your own. But once you conclude that quest line, you will get a number of rewards, and one of them will be the Star Eagle. Now, first thing you'll notice, this is an A-class ship which means anybody can fly it. You don't have to be really high up in your pilot skill in order to simply fly the ship. You can do it at base level. And there is not a single A-class ship I have found in this game that is as powerful as the Star Eagle is. It also has room for seven crewmates, which is a ton. But beyond that, it has lasers, missiles, and EM weapons as well so that you can disable ships. So it has everything going for it right out of the box. You don't have to customize it at all. And it will, it will do wonders for you. So let's go take a quick walk through the ship and then I'll show it to you in combat too. I have taken down entire fleets of the Crimson Fleet out there in space with this thing. So there she be in all of her splendor. That big uh, part on the very tip top, I just threw up there for, to add some extra cargo space, that's all. But that big part up top isn't typically there. It's a bit of an eyesore, I know. Let's step on board. When you step on board, you'll be down here in the sort of mechanical section of the ship and sometimes crewmates will hang out down here. There's a ladder that will take you up, and this is what's cool about it, because this comes from the Ranger's quest line, right? It has a brig. Look, you got a little office set up here, and then you have two prison cells with locks on them, with beds inside. So you can, <laughs> it's like, you can have prisoners in here. It's kind of cool. Another little office space here. And a nice little galley here as well. You know, cooking stations, tables, lounging areas and sleeping areas for crew members. Another ladder up. And up here, these are sort of the captain's quarters. Got another table and a TV. A little restroom, your navigation table, a little uh, captain's area here with a nice bed to sleep in and an office desk. Yeah. Make yourself a pot of coffee in the morning. So in terms of interior space, uh, this ship has a lot going for it. And then we backtrack, and then now we have the main hab that will take us up to the cockpit, which I think is one of the best selling features of this starship. Look how spacious this cockpit is. And the visibility, so much visibility from the cockpit. I absolutely love it. Now let's take it for a spin and I'll show you this baby in action. All right, so here we are. This is the cockpit view, third person view. 
Let's go see if we can find some trouble. All right, we already have some starborn combatants here. I'm gonna power down the grav drive. Power up the lasers. We're chasing them down. I think we've got three of them here. And these guys are worth a lot of XP. I'm gonna hit with EM and missiles at the same time here. That's one down. We've taken down two ships and our shields are still up. Boom. Just like that. We only lost about half our shields, took no hull damage during that exchange. We Gucci. Let's look for more trouble. I also like how maneuverable this ship is too. So if you're having a fight in the middle of like an asteroid field, that's definitely something you can manage. Look at that. How fun is that? Perfect, we got some Varoons. Let's get a lock on them and go into targeting mode. Boom. Let's go for their engines here. There. That Varun ship is uh, now just drifting. Let's go ahead and target the other one in the meantime, huh? Alright. Is this one back up and running now? Let's see. I feel like they're on the move now, aren't they? They are. So let's go into targeting mode. Target their shields. Or, I'm sorry, target their engines. There. Now we're going to dock with it. Let's board them. See if there's anything good in that captain's locker. Let's check that captain's locker, see if there's anything goody in here. Some nice credits for sure. Ooh, some polymers. We can sell this stuff. Some gold in the cargo hold too, we'll take that. And now if we want to, we can just uh, commandeer this ship. So there you go, that is the Star Eagle. Hey, do the Free Star Rangers quest line, get this thing for yourself, and you will be set up for success for a very long time in Starfield. And I do apologize if I seem a little rigid. I actually am just recovering from jaw surgery, so I'm, I'm a little stiff in the talking department. But hey, if you found this helpful, feel free to leave a like on the video, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye.